Welcome to Nursing Learners. Psychiatric Nursing. Question 14. A client expresses the feeling that the armed forces are out to kill him. This could be an example of A. Delusion of grandiosity. B. Delusion of persecution. C. Delusion of jealousy. Or D. Delusion of infidelity. Let's read the question again. A client expresses the feeling that the armed forces are out to kill him. This could be an example of A. Delusion of grandiosity. B. Delusion of persecution. C. Delusion of jealousy. Or D. Delusion of infidelity. The correct answer is B, delusion of persecution. Question 15. Mr. Raju claims that he is the first leader of the world and was born with a special mission in life. These are the symptoms of A, autochthonous delusion. B, delusion of grandeur. C, delusion of persecution. Or D, delusion of reference. Let's read the question again. Mr. Raju claims that he is the first leader of the world and was born with a special mission in life. These are the symptoms of A. Autochthonous delusion. B. Delusion of grandeur. C. Delusion of persecution. Or D. Delusion of reference. The correct answer is B, delusion of grandeur. Question 16. A person thinks that somebody follows him because he had secret papers in his briefcase. It is A, delusion of persecution. B, idea of reference. C, idea of suspect. Or D, delusion of grandeur. Let's read the question again. A person thinks that somebody follows him because he had secret papers in his briefcase. It is A. Delusion of persecution B. Idea of reference C. Idea of suspect Or D. Delusion of grandeur The correct answer is A, delusion of persecution. Question 17. What is the other name for delusion of persecution? A, paranoid delusion. B, grandiose delusion. C, delusion of passivity. Or D, delusion of infidelity. Let's read the question again. What is the other name for Delusion of persecution? A. Paranoid delusion. B. Grandiose delusion. C. Delusion of passivity. Or D. Delusion of infidelity. The correct answer is A, paranoid delusion. Delusions are false, fixed beliefs that cannot be changed even when there is clear evidence against them.
These beliefs are not consistent with the person's cultural, social, or educational background. There are several types of delusions. We will now explore all the different kinds of delusions asked in the previous questions. Delusions of persecution, or paranoid delusions, are false beliefs where a person thinks others are out to harm them. They might believe people are spying on them, conspiring against them, or even trying to kill them. For example, a patient may say, my own family wants to kill me to take away my property. Even if there's no proof, the person is 100% convinced it's true. In question 14, the false belief that the armed forces want to kill the person, and in question 16, the belief that someone is secretly following them, both are classic examples of delusions of persecution, where the person wrongly believes that someone is trying to harm, threaten, or spy on them. Delusions of grandiosity, or delusions of grandeur. Here, a person has an exaggerated sense of self-importance, they might believe they have special powers, great talent, or a unique connection with someone famous, or even think they are God. For example, a patient saying, I am the chosen one, or I have a direct connection with the prime minister. In question 15, Mr. Raju's claim that he is the first leader of the world, or that he was born for a special mission in life. These are clear examples of delusions of grandiosity where a person has an exaggerated belief about their importance, power, or identity. Delusion of infidelity, or delusion of jealousy. This is a false belief that one's partner is being unfaithful, even when there's no evidence at all. The person becomes obsessed with the idea that their spouse or lover is cheating on them. For example, a man constantly accuses his wife of having an affair with her colleague, despite having no proof, and even when she's never done anything suspicious. Delusions of reference or ideas of reference. This is when a person falsely believes that everyday events or people's actions are directly related to them. They might think people are secretly talking about them or that media messages are meant specifically for them. For example, I saw a news headline today. It was clearly about me. Or, those people laughing over there? They're laughing at me. Delusions of control. This is the false belief that some outside force is controlling one's thoughts, feelings, or actions. It could be a person, machine, or even something supernatural. For example, my neighbor is controlling my mind using some device. Or, I'm not moving my hands. Someone else is doing it. There are many types of delusions in psychiatry, but make sure to remember these five explained in this video because they're frequently asked in exams and are clinically very important. Thanks for watching the video. Please like, share, and subscribe Nursing Learners for more such videos.